Hi everybody, this is Joe. And this is Jenna. From Fantastic Reviews. We are coming at you today with another unboxing. Jenna, what are we unboxing today? We are doing Nerd Block. And I will, I have my knife over this way, away from you. So it's Nerd Block. I forget what the theme is, <laughs> but I know I wanted to get it because Batman the Animated uh, Series was supposed to be in this box. And I cannot pass up anything with Batman the Animated Series. That is my jam. It's true. It's While she's jam. opening the box, uh, we're really excited because we got to meet Kevin Conroy and Mark Hamill at Fan Expo Canada <gasps> so last awesome. month. Uh, no, this month. It was, uh, what, two, three weeks ago, actually, yeah, that we met the, them. The first of this month we did. So uh, you probably heard that on one of our previous podcasts, if you've been listening to our previous podcasts. Uh, so If you haven't been listening to our podcasts, go back and listen to it. And then come back here and we'll tell you again how amazing it was to meet these two. Super nice people. Mark Hamill's line was ridiculous. Yeah. But Kevin Conroy's line was just as ridiculous. Yeah. It was... I felt a little bit bad for Burt Ward and uh, Adam West because there was nobody in their line. There never like, usually is. Yeah. Anyway, back anyway, to the unboxing. So, back to the unboxing. So, here we go. I have it open. I had my knife ready this time rather than struggling with it for two minutes <laughs> at a time. So, here we go. Ooh. Oh, so here's what here's what it looks like so far. So what's this on top? Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge phone case. Ugh. Who are you gonna call? That's pretty cool. Neither <laughs> of us have this phone. I have the Galaxy S6, but not the Galaxy S6 Edge. S6 Edge. That's, but that's a pretty sweet phone that's case. That's pretty cool. If anybody has this phone and wants this case, send us a message and I will send this to you because we can't use it. But you have to like this vi video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Yeah. Tell your friends to subscribe and then trick your enemies into also subscribing. Either way, we'll send this to you. That's okay. good. Yeah, we could have a giveaway. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's just going to sit here and rot. <laughs> so <laughs> we might as well give it to someone. So if you uh, like and subscribe, comment on our video. And uh, if you're the lucky person that we choose, we will send you the Galaxy 6... Uh, God, why am I having trouble saying this? Because you're sick. Galaxy S6 Edge Ghostbusters phone case. Yes. Again, it says, who you got to call? That's so clever. Yeah. I kind of want to go out and get this phone just to use this case, but I'm not going to. All right. Uh, next, we have a set of pins from Star Wars. Oh, a button four pack. So that's that's pretty neat right there. That's pretty, that's pretty cool. neat. Again... Oh, wow. I'm not going to use these, so comment and like and subscribe, and we'll send this to one of you guys, too. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just give away all sorts just of stuff. Just give away all the stuff that I don't want, yeah. <laughs> that's that's nice, right? That's a nice thing. This is a... Oh, it's a scarf. It's a scarf. It's an Attack on Titan scarf. That's cool. Okay, I don't know anything about Attack on Titan. It looks terrifying from the face mask. Well, because the Titans are pretty much... They don't really have skin. It's just mostly, like tendon and muscle that you see so that's kind of so they created that. it with tendons and muscle and couldn't just put out the extra 50 bucks for skin that's cheap i'm sorry that's a bad program i don't know anything about i i program. haven't i don't i haven't watched attack <laughs> on titan either i should i i want to and i've just never gotten around to it uh so but i don't know maybe we should just complain to the titans as to why they don't have skin do they care are they robots i don't know enough about it yeah I don't know. Okay, next we got... This is cool. Okay, so this is pretty neat. This is the Joker oh. action figure from Batman the Animated Series. Wish we had gotten that a month ago and had Mark Hamill sign it. Ah, uh, it's plasticky. I don't know what kind of pen he would have had to use. Well, you, you have him sign the, the back of it. Yeah. Not the top, like right up here. Right up there. Oh, well. Next time, for another $200 to go see Mark <laughs> Hamill. I'm good with the one we got. It was $200 Canadian, though, so we actually made out on it. Yeah, from all the things. Okay. Uh, ooh, there's something stuck to this. All right, next. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, it's a book from Star Trek. Fun <laughs> with Kirk and Spock. A parody. What is I'm it? I'm assuming it's Fun with Dick and Jane. Oh, my God. And, yes, it is. <laughs> sea Bones. Sea Bones is upset. Kirk wants Bones to help with the... Horta? Horta. I'm a doctor, not a bricklayer, Bones says. But Bones helps the Horta. Bones is pleased with himself. And that's the picture. <laughs> okay, that's great. I'm sorry, none of you are getting this. It's I'm done in good old 60s, <laughs> 70s art style. That's yeah. actually pretty didn't funny. You ever, didn't you ever read that book when you were a kid? Yeah. Fun with yeah. Dick and Jane? Mm -hmm, yeah. Mm -hmm. well, that's good. Which is cool because it is, uh, uh, since this year is the 50th anniversary of Star Trek, so that's kind of a big deal. Yeah. 
Okay, next we have a shirt. Snape. Snape. Oh, that's what it says. It says Snape. Did you have trouble reading it? Well, I couldn't really tell what it was doing there for a second. <laughs> it's Snape. It's got Alan Rickman's eyes. Oh, Alan Rickman. That's a cool shirt. I'm not sure what that has to do with the theme, because I don't remember what the theme was. <laughs> but that's... There you go. We'll look that up and we'll put it in the comments or something. It's probably, we'll it out. It's probably on one of these things. So, let's see. It's probably on this. So, here we go. Uh, no. Nope. It doesn't say. Nope. It just says all the things that are exclusive. Um, so, in the, little, in the little thing we have, we've got the, oh, we get the $10 shirt punch card. Uh, which is cool if you'd like to go to that website for a shirt punch. I've gotten the last two nerd blocks. I've gotten one of these. Um, it's really great, except I haven't wanted any of the shirts right now, so I haven't used them. <laughs> so, um, you know, but, but we have this, which is a really neat thing. It really offsets the cost of the box if you like to go and buy shirts yourself. Because the shirts there are usually 16 bucks, 20 Something bucks. Like so you're getting it for half price with this little coupon. And we have so many of them. We have so many shirts. So many. So many shirts. So, let's see. Uh, so we have the $10 shirt punch card. We have the fun with Kirk and Spock thing. So the shirt is exclusive to NerdBlock. The Ghostbusters, who you gonna call, is exclusive to NerdBlock. So is the Attack on Titan scarf. Batman the Animated Series, this is cool. You could have gotten one of three. It looks like you could have gotten uh, Penguin, Joker, or Batgirl. Hmm. So I got the good one. That's yeah. good. I mean, if, if anybody else got anything, those are also cool, but I like the Joker the best, so, of the three of them. And then the four pack buttons were also exclusive to NerdBlock, so, that's pretty neat. That's, that's There's cool. also a little card in here about what October's NerdBlock is going to be. It's going to feature an exclusive from The Walking Dead, which, to be honest, I'm kind of over. We stopped watching that halfway Midway through, through the prison season. Yeah. When Lori died, we stopped watching after Lori died. Oh, yeah. spoilers, I guess. It's, show that's... Anyone that's keeping up with Walking Dead has already known. Yeah, so, she's dead. I, I don't feel bad. It's been four years. I'm glad she's dead. Uh, along with other supernatural items from Beetlejuice and Ghostbusters yeah. for next month. Yay. So in case anyone is interested in See, October's Nerd Block. That, that, that leaves me torn because I really like Beetlejuice. But I don't care about The Walking Dead, and I'm sure a lot of it's going to be Walking Dead, and I don't care. I'd rather just have it, just Michael Keaton, just everything in that box. Yeah. So, so maybe we'll get maybe we'll get it next month. I have to decide on that one because that's that's a lot of stuff that I don't care for. They've been putting Ghostbuster stuff in every box since that movie came out. Like every single one, there's been some Ghostbuster something in it, which is cool. But I'm over it now. I don't need more <laughs> Ghostbuster stuff. So. so what is your overall impression of this month's Nerd Box? I have to say I'm very impressed. I liked it uh, this month. Not just because of the Batman the Animated Series Joker <laughs> figurine. I don't really collect figurines. I will be keeping that, but there's really nothing for me to do with it. But um, overall, I'd say some really good stuff in here. Definitely worth my money. Um, this block with shipping, I believe, is around $30. So, I mean, you definitely, you definitely got what you paid for for this. With the fun book, which I really enjoyed. I got a kick out of that because I remember books like that. Uh, the animated series Joker. The phone case, which those are at least 10 bucks <coughs> at a store. And then the t-shirt, which again, another $10. You just, a box just almost paid for itself with just those two items. So, um, I really enjoyed it. Um, not everything was catered to me this month, but that's what the risk you run when you get mystery boxes. But I did enjoy it. What did you, what did you think? I thought they were great. I think that I would use that phone case if I could. Oh, yeah. That's it's a really good sweet. phone case. So, again, if you like the phone case and didn't get this month's nerd block. And the buttons. And the buttons. And <clears> do you want that Attack on Titan thing? Probably not. All three of these will be given <laughs> away to somebody or three persons. So, like, subscribe, comment. Trick, comment. Well, you have to because otherwise we won't know who you are. Comment. And then have your friends like, subscribe, and then trick your enemies into liking and subscribing so that you can. 
forever be enemies. Our goal right now is to get 100 subscribers on our channel so that we can get a custom URL so that we can <laughs> tell actually tell people what YouTube channel, what YouTube address to go to rather than UFVWJ. So this is not a string of random letters and numbers. Lowercase like, I, I don't two. think that's a good thing to click on when we send those links to people. They're like, I think you got hacked. That's yeah. not right. Yeah. Who would have known? We have 10 whole subscribers. Yeah. Most of them are us. But that's besides the point. <laughs> so overall, I did enjoy this month's nerd block. Um, we do have a couple other mystery boxes coming this month. We'll be doing a few more unboxings. And then we'll be on to October's month. Ooh, the spookiest month, which is my favorite month. October's a so, good month. October's a good month. So, yeah. But that's everything here. Again, like, subscribe, comment. Trick other people into doing the same. And you will be entered into our giveaway for this month. There's probably going to be one person who does it, so congratulations one person who actually follows these instructions. Pretty much. <laughs> you can also find us on Facebook. If you go to facebook.com backslash Fantastic Reviews Podcast, you can also find us on Twitter at Fantastic Podcast without the A at the end because Twitter does not let me put that many characters in the handle. There will be links to that in the comments below. Yep. All right. Bye, Internet. Bye.